Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to the shed. I'm Lonnie. Uh, Candace is over here listing, supposedly. Yeah. I was going over this point and an email jumped out at me. Okay. Email jumped out at you. <laughs> Candace is working on a hot, like a Hot Wheel lot or something over there. Uh, and we are going to be pulling some orders over here. Actually, we already did. Um, have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight things going out today. Would have been more. Um, had a pretty good sales day yesterday, but I shipped. I shipped pretty much everything that came, that got ordered up till about two o'clock or so. So these are the orders that happened from two o'clock to uh, till now. Let's take a look. Uh, first thing is this lot of Jimmy Buffett. Five Jimmy Buffett CD sold for $12.99 plus shipping. Here is the Cleaver. Sold this for $37.99 plus shipping. And I don't know. And after looking at the after looking at the uh, other comps there, I think in like really good condition or in better condition, you'd be looking at about 50 bucks. And I felt like my condition wasn't that great. So I put it at $37.99 and it sold really fast. Um, sold two makeups. It's eight hour cream and some kind of sun sunscreen stuff. $66.98. Free ship for that. Ooh, I need to put my stuff on uh, sale again. And then um, sold the G.I. Joe space capsule, space suit, and other accessories and whatnot. It does not have the figure but it has pretty much everything else i think 89.90 for that at auction that was a really good one uh sold some chem playing cards for 19.99 plus ship paid we actually had another box and they were messed up so uh threw those out and paid 25 cents per box so 25 cents into 20 dollars it's pretty good little uh, bread and butter type thing. Uh, sold a Razor Freestyle Scooter Dreamcast game to Tyler. Tyler, thank you very much. Appreciate that. And Robert bought this Harley Davidson t-shirt that I listed yesterday for $9.99 plus shipping. And supposed to have another order. Oh, there it is. This order must have just come in. Uh, sold this Clinique makeup for $32.99 free ship. So let me get all this stuff packed and we'll see what else we get into. Okay, we are working on some like bigger projects, I guess, listing a little higher dollar stuff. Candace is working on, what's this thing called, Candace? It's a... Um, Sweetheart. Sweetheart's part, uh, wishing well park. Yeah, and when we opened it up, um, or when Candace opened it up, look, most of the stuff is still on the trees. Everything is except for these four little pieces. Yeah. So, and like the foliage is still bagged. Yeah, sealed. Yeah. Check that out. Sealed. Made in Hong Kong. And it's all clean. I mean, if you look at... Um, oh, it's got these big pieces. Yeah, they've never been put together. Look, yeah. this still has like... Where oh, the yeah. Plastic, like yeah. The manufacturing. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, I'm over here. We are, we are not... We have been in kind of a weird mode today. We ran some errands. We started late. Didn't have a whole lot of packages going out. I feel I I kind of feel like not not busting butt too much today. I really do. But I do want to get. Um, I am going to get this cleaned up. This rainbow it actually works fine. Oh, it won't. I guess it won't power on when it's not on the base. It must have some kind of lockout circuit. But uh, it does. Like in this position, it uh, vacuums. In this position, it's air purifier. So I need to get it cleaned up though, because this thing is disgusting. And I'm gonna hose this off, this base off, and I'm gonna clean this up best I can. There may be a filter in here or something that I have to take out. I don't know. I'm gonna break it down, and I'm probably gonna spend about an hour or something on this thing. But it works. Um, it's an E2, E series E2. So it's not the it's not the newest, latest, greatest, most expensive, but it's still going to be very good profit. And um, yeah, let me see how clean I can get this sucker. 
we filmed a little uh, demo video, which I thought was pretty funny. Did a little bit of cleanup on the vacuum here, and I just want to show y'all how it works. We do have the other hose for it too. Oh no, we spilled some Cheez-Its. <laughs> oh my gosh, what are we gonna do? <laughs> Shot that cheesy little video, like a minute long video, just showing uh, showing this thing working, and yeah, it's all working. So popping it up here on the bench snapping some photos real quick and getting it listed um, I could try and do like perfect background perfect listing all that kind of stuff but with this I need to go ahead and list this thing and move on pretty good day today uh, even though we didn't we weren't quite as maybe productive as we planned on uh, Candace is she just like wait hey whoa 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 hang on all right, so anyways, uh, Candace had to hurry up. Your hair looked fine, but she hurried up and put on the I rarest hat. She had to hurry up and put on the rarest hat in the world, the getaway gang hat. <laughs> and then, uh, so I saw her put that hat on. So I put my hat on. Look at my new hat. <laughs> I got a hat. <laughs> I, I, I'm wearing a hat. Candace, <laughs> Can, Candace is making fun of me right now because she knows I do not have a hat head, a head for a hat. My head is not good with a hat on it. So. But anyway, yeah, Matt over at Part Time Pickers, he sent me one of these that he's selling now. It's a pretty cool hat if you're a hat person. I'm not, but I'm glad to have this one. But maybe we'll just uh, maybe we'll just put it on the skeleton guy there or something. I don't know. What? You go ahead. You gonna tell me no? Uh, we'll decorate with it somewhere because, I, like I said, I'm wearing it now. But I'm just not the hat, the hat dude. Where can I put it? I need we'll have to find another head. Yeah, we will. We'll, we'll have to find another skeleton head or something to put it on. But yeah, thank you very much, Matt, over at Part Time Pickers. Like I said, I'm not a hat guy, <laughs> but I'm glad I have it. Um, what was I gonna say? Uh, I don't know. You were talking about something, and I realized you had the camera rolling, so I threw it. Like, ah! She like freaked out, like I was gonna aim the camera at her. And then keep the keep the footage in. Anytime she tells me to take footage out, I'll take it out. That's kind of the rule. But no, I'm out here working. I had to do this like crazy, crazy videos. Look, I've got 49 friggin' thumbnails since I've been doing that again. Oh, uh, that was your shit video oh, yesterday? For Sunday, for Sunday night. Yeah. Those, are the, those are 49 items I did Sunday night. Then I came back out the next day and did, I don't know, 30 more or something. So yeah. it was a... Good weekend. Yeah, very good weekend. Yep. Um, today, we managed to pull out a decent day. I listed a bunch of like, uh, we had some Bibles that are pretty good. This is a, a pretty good one. I had this set of books here. Candace did some action figures. Um, I did a Sweethearts in the Park. Yeah, you did Fresh that. Park. We had a good day. Like, we didn't list a ton of stuff, but we listed some higher value stuff. Like, we must have... We must have put up like six hundred, seven hundred dollars worth of stuff, so yeah. it was pretty good. Um, I did list the um, vacuum cleaner I was showing y'all earlier, and uh, the harmonicas that were stuck, where the drafts were stuck, and the eBay glitch wouldn't let me like publish those drafts. Well, I waited twenty-four hours after talking to support, and it was still doing the same thing, so. I said forget it and I just I had the drafts on this side and I had an active listing window over here and I would just like copy all the information from the draft paste it into a new listing and then listed it and I was having to go in and save all the photos because we we don't we don't hang on to photos after we take them we should I guess but I had to go through and save as save as save as on each photo I finally got all those listings out. So we're at uh what 52 out of 480? Yep. Okay, good. What's it looking like for tomorrow? What's tomorrow gonna be like? As far as what listing and stuff? Working? Yeah. <laughs> as far as working, yeah, of course. Yeah. Um I think we pretty much have everything we picked up from the garage sale. Yeah, the only thing I have left that I need to work on from garage sales, I think. I have these, this car that's going to be like, I'm definitely doing that tomorrow. 
And then we have um, a rainbow rain mate. Yeah, I need to test it still. I'm letting it dry out. I cleaned it up. Yeah, Candace used some vinegar. You know what? I'm going to work on these tomorrow. What is that? Oh, yeah. Welcome well, back, Cotter and Mork from Mork and Mindy. Yeah, that's some cool cool ones in there. I'm going to work on those tomorrow. Okay, good. Oh, the, the other thing, uh, I had this pet safe wireless pet containment yep. system, but uh, I did order last night, Candace. They make the little testers. Oh, to, check, to test it? It's a test tool, and you like, they send you a little dog yeah a little dog yeah <laughs> god what a horrible thing that would be but uh, they make a little test tool that you like hold across these elect electrodes <laughs> and um for the record last time we got one of these i wouldn't let him sell it no it wasn't one of these though it was just a anyway there's a shock collar i don't know there's a little tester thing and it tells you when when this th thing gets energized uh, and I and I want to test that so and I can sell it with that because people that buy those they want the te the test tool because then they can kind of set adjust the range setting on the on the machine there on the box and they can figure out like where exactly their dog can go and I think a lot of people even like to use I don't have the flags but they make flags you can put out to let your dog know how far they can go before they're out of range of the thing. So that's the whole idea. So I'm buying the test tool to test it and I'm also gonna include the test tool with it when I sell it. So the test tool was only like seven bucks shipped. So hmm. yeah, so that's my two big things. Cars, that thing, and then I'm gonna list some uh, cards and it'll be a good day. So. Yeah. That's it. That's it for tonight. Uh, you got anything else? Any words of wisdom, parting words, or anything special you need to say to anybody? Nope. Can y'all hear the rain on the roof? Yeah, it's raining hard. Yeah, we're getting <laughs> some bad weather again. Yep. But anyway, yeah, let's just talk, start talking about the weather. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching, y'all. Bye.